Hello lovely people, welcome to the Geek of it. I am Penjin, welcome to Inch by Inch. So Inch by Inch is a game where we are going to play as a scientist who is working in a lab and all that sounds quite ordinary so far but then some sort of disaster befalls us and we end up shrinking. So we're in our lab and we end up shrinking and getting smaller and smaller. So we have to then run around the lab and procure different ingredients and I don't know chemicals and concoctions and mix them together in the right way in order to make an antidote to stop us shrinking. But obviously the smaller we get, the harder it's going to be to use the machinery in the lab and all that kind of stuff. And then I guess if we don't do it, we just shrink out of existence altogether. We just shrink down to absolutely nothing and just cease to exist. So this sounds like a lot of fun. It's free. It's free on Itch.io if you want to go and check it out. Um, so let's have a go. We've got it on Difficulty Scientist, which is the kind of standard difficulty. There's Lab Intern, which is presumably very easy. Scientist, which is sort of middling. And Professor, which is very hard. Everything else is all ordinary. I haven't played this yet, so let's see what happens. So we'll put the tutorial on, because from what I read, the tutorial kind of introduces you to the concepts of the game. Without the tutorial, we are going to be totally and utterly bamboozled. So let's play with the tutorial on and just see what happens. So it looks quite lovely, as I remember. There we go. So a new day at the lab. Let's get started. What I need now is Ignatium. Ignatium? Luckily, there is some on my desk. Let's pick it up. Well, that's fortunate. Right, I assume it's where this big yellow arrow is pointing. Uh, what does that say? Looking for a recipe or formula? Just search for hints on notepads or clipboards. You can sometimes find these in drawers too. Okay, yes, yeah, so we've got a, a lab, a fairly extensive lab. It's very white. <laughs> Some sort of heavenly lab. Oh, there's a clipboard. What does that say? Ignatium. Ignatium, possibly. And water equals, what does that say? Explodium. Oh, explodium sounds fun. Right, uh, oh, there you go. Ignatium. Right, okay, let's pick it up. So right click is hold. Oh, nearly dropped it. Time for some science. Let's put the, this Ignatium into the distillator. 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 Uh, do I just... Do, do I drop it? Oh, right. Okay. Drop it in. Now, this machine needs two ingredients. So, let's get some water and put it into the distillator. Distillator. Water. Okay. Well, there's a tap. Get water. Oh, okay. Right. I don't know if that, it's, I just sort of magically acquire water, do I? Oh, it's in a little kind of... It's in a little test tube thing. Of course it is. Uh, okay. Put that in. Okay. Sw switch it on. All I need to do now is turn it on. Okay. Well, activate. That would make sense. A little sort of clock thing. Spinny circle, spinny spin. Ah, <laughs> I think if there was ever anything that I wouldn't want to spill over, I would say it was explodium. The next step is to put this new ingredient into our bioreactor. Okay, we're remembering this, everybody. Bioreactor. Okay, put that into the bioreactor. The bioreactor only takes a single ingredient, but also requires a code to be programmed. Okie doke. I wrote down the code and put it into one of the drawers. Just can't remember which one. Uh, oh, okay, right. Well, it would make sense that, that it was this one. Well, I guess we'll have to search the drawers. Oh, okay, it's not a drawer that's next to the thing then. No, so very foolishly, I've just left it in a drawer somewhere. Okay, well, there were some drawers over here. Was it one of these? No. Was it that drawer? Was it this drawer? No, that's the same drawer. Open the bottom drawer. No, that one. Ah, there, 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 there. What, what is it? Hold. Ah, there it is. This is the formula I need with the correct code for the bioreactor. So Explodium plus 7283. Uh, okay, 7283. Uh, enter code. 7283. Go. Uh, perfect, it worked. Let's wait for a moment. Right, that's doing a thing. Now it's become Xenolium. Hooray. So Explodium plus 7283. If I got to remember all this, <laughs> I can't remember any of these numbers. All I need to do now is to put this into the microwave and turn it on. Oh, I see. You've got a, whatever that was, a distillator, a distillator, a distillator. I don't know how you say that word. A bioreactor. Then you've got a microwave. <laughs> okay. Right. Okay. Put that in there then. Uh, turn it on. Click. The microwave is a lot easier to use than the other machines, but it also takes the longest to finish. Okay, right, so that's going to take some time to complete. Right, yes, you're not joking. Sheesh, this takes ages. I suppose it is creating microwave energy to blast your pollulium with, whatever it was. Uh, <laughs> I've just made a very elaborate cup of coffee, have I? A nice hot cup of coffee. Oh, splendid. It's not a cup, though. It's a kind of, uh, a kind of laboratory beaker thing. Now the real work can begin. Okay. What do I do now then? Do I go out the door? Oh no, it's fading. Oh, I've, I've died. <laughs> okay, right. Now what? 
get water. Do I want to get water? I kind of feel funny. Okay. Am I shrinking already? Maybe I should stop using our lab equipment <laughs> to make coffee. That'll be a good idea. Okay. I kind of went notice on the left. Okay. What's this? I'm shrinking. So on the left is a pointy thing telling me how, how tall I am. Okay. Okay. No panic. All I need are the three key components for the antidote. Okay. Where are they? <laughs> the formulas and ingredients have to be around here. Somewhere. Oh, don't say somewhere. I don't know. Oh, goodness me. Darkium and Tylium is Xenoleum. Lynxium and Microb equals Geogitanium. How do I know what the, the thing is? Oh, there's an antidote processor just there. Do I need the computer for anything? Okay, so look, on the left, I am actively shrinking right now. I'm actually shrinking. How do I know what I need to do? How do I know what I need to do? Key three. Exotium and 7764. Have a, what? There's some things lying around. Exotium. Right, that's... Okay, it's green. I think that was this. Okay, 7764. Go. Okay, while I'm waiting, I should keep looking for the other ingredients and formula. Okay, that sounds like a good idea. That sounds like a very good idea. Um, okay, do I need to... Do I need to look in? I'm going to have to look in cupboards and stuff then, am I? Uh, Darkium. Okay, that, that's probably important. Uh, what's that thing? What's this? Hold. Uh, okay, I don't know what that is. That's random junk, it said. Okay, nothing in there. Nothing in there. Oh, no. There's, there's drawers of plenty. Oh, right, okay. What's that? Geogitanium plus 4297 is key one. Geogitanium. Hang on, was that on there? Lynxium. Oh, goodness me. Where's Lynxium? Where's Lynxium? How do I fight? Is that Lynxium? Please be Lynxium. Ah, right. Good. What did it say? Lynxium and microwave. Okay, I can do that. Put that in the microwave. Switch it on. Lynxium and microwave equals geogitanium. And geogitanium... I am getting... I'm actually physically getting smaller. I can feel myself not able to look over the top of these things quite clearly. Okay. Uh, plus that is is key one. Okay, well, let's put that round here. Ah, we've got key three. That's probably good. So let's pick... Don't spill it, <laughs> you fool. Okay, this goes into this thing, I assume. Yes. Right, the antidote to process. Right, I've got one antidote. That's probably a good thing. Um, how do I make the other the other stuff? Where's the other stuff? Uh, uh, the microwave. Is the microwave still microwaving? Yeah, it's still doing its thing. Right, okay. Let's open all the other drawers. What else is there? I need to find more things, I would think. More more ingredients or whatever. Nothing in there. Nothing in there. Nothing in any of these. Uh, okay. Anything in the cupboard? Have I opened these cupboards already? I possibly have opened these already, haven't I? That's a fridge. That's, that's possibly a good source of stuff. Darkium and Tylium. What was that? What was that stuff? Uh, I can't... Oh, no. <laughs> I'm too small. I can't get onto the side. Hang on. Right. Jumpy jump. Jumpy jump. Uh, oh, there. I might need that. Ty Darkium and Tylium. Uh, how do I... Ah, is this thing? Oh, there's a thing there. There's a thing there. Xenoleum and microbe. Did that make Xenoleum? Darkium and Tylium equals Xenoleum. Okay. Well, that's that. And then where was the Darkium? Oh, look at me. I'm only just the height of the things now. <laughs> Become teeny tiny. Okay. Drop that into there. Uh, activate. Right, switch that on. Okay, that's going to take ages. That's going to take absolutely ages. Right, run, 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 run. Right, that... that I, I can't do anything. I can't do anything. What do I need for that? Darkium and Tylium is Xenoleum. Oh, no. What was on the thing? What did I have to do with Xenoleum? Xenoleum and microwave. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is taking so long. Come on. All these things need to be done now. Right, that microwave is nearly done. So if I... <laughs> If I reach up out of that, is that key one? Geoctane it. Oh no, I need to do something else with this as well. What was it? Did I need to put that into the bioreactor? Oh, where was the, th the things up on there, isn't it? The thing is up on there. Right, I need another box. Come here, box. Oh no, no, grab the box. Come here, box. Come here, box. It's got a circle. I can't, why can't I pick the box up? Is the box now too big? Maybe the <laughs> maybe the box is now too big for me to actively pick up. Okay, there. Geoctanium four two nine seven. Uh, okay, yeah, four four two nine seven. Go make a thing out of that. So that makes key one, uh, and that makes key xenoleum and microbe is key two. So now I've got xenoleum or whatever it is. Right, how how am I gonna? <laughs> I'm one foot eleven. I can't reach the microwave. 
It's too high up. Right, okay. Uh, yeah, that's, that's a little bit too high. A stool. A stool might be good. They've got wheels up, so I can sort of push it round. Uh, oh, God, I'm very slow. I'm very slow. Presumably because I'm one foot eight, and this is actually quite a big thing. I don't think I can get on that stool, can I? Right, and a bin. A stool and a little sort of pedal bin, trash bin thing. That'll do. Uh, oh, no, I've forgotten the thing. Right, g grab the thing. Grab the zinoleum. Right, come round. Can I jump onto the bin? Can I? J am I that tall? Can I jump onto that? Right, put put in microwave. Switch on microwave. Uh, that is doing that. Uh, okay. Right, now I need to... I'm one foot six. <laughs> right, can I reach that? Can I reach that from down it? Can I jump and grab it, do you reckon? Uh... No, oh no, I need to... Ah, ha 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 ha, the bin, I can stand on the bin. Right, give me that stuff, please. Yes, key one. Yes, my second key ingredient. Quickly add it to the antidote processor. Only one more. I've had to move the stool to get to the thing for the antidote processor. <laughs> I've had to move the stool. Hang on, wait there. Wait, 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 wait. Right, I grab that. I can't, I can't, oh, I can't move anything anymore. Uh, okay, right. Is there some other really clever way that I can actively get to there? Bear in mind that I'm only about a foot tall now. Oh, I can't even jump onto the onto this box that's on its side. It's not even like it's the right way up box. It's on its side and I can't do it. No, I'm going to shrink into nothingness. Oh, dearie me. Um, yeah, I, I, I think I might have failed this one. I don't think that went very well. <laughs> I think I might be stuck. Oh, now if I had to put that drawer out, that drawer could act as a step. Right, okay. Well, we are... Go I'm, I'm not I'm not being beaten by this, even though I'm a foot tall. Even though I'm a tiny little, tiny little borrower man. Look, I can fit through all the gaps though, can't I? Why didn't I just go out and ask for help? I don't know. Uh, ah, look. On the left, there is a red... There's a red bit now. When you get to, uh, what, seven inches high, then you... Uh, that, that Presumably that is game over. Um, I can't do anything now. I can hide in this corner... Presumably I can get ready to have a fight with, I don't know, some rodents or a moth or something. I'm going to be about that high. Look, I'm the same height as a test tube. Oh, my vision's going to weird as well. I'm the same height as a little sort of test tube with a with a base on it. What What is one of those called? I don't actually know what a test tube with a base is called. I'm not entirely sure. Because a test tube doesn't have a, a bottom it like that, does it? It doesn't have a flat base. They've got a rounded bottom bit and they just sort of, if you put them down so they would fall over. That's why you have a test tube rack. So I don't know what that is. A thin beaker or something? What? Whatever. I don't know what it is. Um. Okay. I think. I think this might all be over. I think I might need to restart this one. <laughs> I don't think this has gone very well at all. Oh, can I fit down here? Oh, not quite. Oh. Oh, there's something there. What's that there? Can I get down here yet? No, but there is certainly something etched onto the side of there. Look. What's that? Oh, now that's intriguing. Maybe at my absolute smallest point, because I'm now. What, 9.3 inches high? At some point, I'm going to be able to fit down here. Oh, not long, look. I'm going to go down there and see what that says. That's going to be like a little Easter egg message or something, isn't it? Let's just have a little walk over here. I say little walk. It's quite long now. I've got tiny little legs. Look, come on, come on. I can fit down this gap now. Yeah. What does that say? It says... M Ma I can't read it. Marig was here. Thanks for visiting. <laughs> Yay. Oh, a little Easter egg. That's nice. Um, okay, right. Yeah, I think it's over. Now, I am intrigued to see what happens when it gets down to uh, gets down to that red bit. But uh, I can't really do anything else. So let's just see what happens when it gets to the red line there, uh, about seven inches high. What happens? Do I just explode? Does, does, does my brain pop out of my head or something? I don't know. Let's wait and find out, shall we? Okay, here comes the threshold. So... Yeah, it's not quite a seven inch limit there. I don't know why. I don't know why it's ever so slightly above seven inches there. So seven point what one? Seven point one inches is it going to be? Ish? Yeah, I think so. There we go. So I, I, I'm going into the red bit there. Uh oh. Yeah. Uh oh. I think that's right. I think I'm too small now to use any of our equipment. Yeah, you were too small quite a long while ago to do anything because I didn't actually set up any steps or anything. Hopefully, I don't get any smaller. Then maybe someone will find me on Monday. <laughs> Okay, so I'm just going to wander around the lab fending off attacks from rats, whatever. Oh, and there we go. Game over. So I can restart, I can continue playing for whatever reason. Maybe it's so you can go and find that secret message. Um, or you can just restart. Well, I'm going to restart. Let's give this, let's give this another go. So, da-da. So we've, we've reappeared and I believe 
Uh, I'm just going to start shrinking straight away. Right, I kind of feel funny. Right, let's get on with it. Let's not read the stuff. Parabolium plus 7049. Look how tall I am. Right, okay. Important thing first. Get that down from up there because that will be practically impossible to get. Uh, and nothing in the upper cupboards, I don't think. What was that? Ignatium, Ignatium. Uh, Geoctanium, Darkium, and Strawberry Jam. Strawberry Jam? Okay. <laughs> it's all gone a bit weird. Strawberry Jam. Okay, right. Uh, drawers. Let's just check the drawers. Let's check drawers. Right, there's a thing. There's a thing on there. Uh, explodium and water is key one. I don't like the sound of Explodium. Oh, no, there's an awful lot of notepads. Uh, Ignatium and 0367. But where is the Ignatium? Where is all of the stuff? Is it all in cupboards this time around? Is it all packed away? Have I actually tidied the lab? Uh, in there? No. In here? This is a cupboard. No. Ah! 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 ah right. There's stuff at the top. Right. Get the stuff out of the top of there as well, because that would be... No, 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 don't spill it. <laughs> oh, maybe it doesn't spill. Maybe it doesn't actually spill. Strawberry jam. Right, and one thing I was going to do was, there's a drawer there. Open that drawer to use as a kind of step. Okay, right. What was it? I can't remember anything. Strawberry jam and darkium. Where's darkium? Uh, is darkium somewhere really obvious that I can't see? Oh, it's up there. It's up there. Look, there's a thing up there. They've, they've done some very good putting things very high, haven't they? Right, darkium and strawberry jam. So that's darkium. This is a bit weird. Strawberry jam. <laughs> right you are. So darkium. Was it darkium and strawberry jam? Just quickly check. It was geoignitanium or whatever that's called. Right, so that's going to do that. And then microwave that is key two. Okay, that's fine. I can do that. Uh, key one is explodium and water. Right, is one of these explodium? No. Oh, how do I make explodium? Does it tell me? Ah, is it up here? Is it up here? Parabolium. Uh, para, parabolium. Um, no, I don't know where all the stuff is. Is it in here? Is there something in here? Uh, no. Okay, hang on. Does it tell me how to make parabolium on here? Uh, ignatium and 0367. Have I got some ignatium? Ignatium and zero. Ah, right. Okay, right. We need to put that into there. Zero, three, six, seven. Go. Do a thing. Uh, okay, right. Okay, here we go. So let's make ourselves a little step just here. So let's put that down there. Right, and then grab this thing because I can move these around fairly easy. Now put that there. Grab that. Put that there. No, don't put that like that though because that's stupid. Put that there. Uh, we've got a drawer. Oh, now, can we leave the drawers open? Because that would help. Because I can hop onto the drawers because I slowly start shrinking down into nothingness. Um, oh, no, I didn't put the thing over there. What's that? What's... Oh, no, that, what is that? That's geoctanium. Ah, right, and geoctanium and something is is an important thing. Geoctanium and microwave. Right, I can probably still reach the microwave, I imagine. Yes, turn it on. Right, so we've got one of them done. Geoctanium and microwave is key too. Okay, that's good. That's good news. What was what was this thing in here? Did we put a thing in the bioreactor? Oh, I can't remember. Was it? Did we put a thing in there? Uh, okay, don't know what we put in there. Parabolium. What what did we need next? So we've done ignatium and zero three six seven is explodium. Have we got explodium? Did we get explodium out of this? Is that explodium? I oh, know it's still. Oh, is it there now? Oh, right. Oh, it just hadn't finished. Right. Explodium uh, is... Uh, and water. Explodium and water. Okay. Let me get water. Bibbly bobbly boo. Come on, get water quicker than this. I'm two foot tall almost. Right. Get water. No, don't get any more water. I want to pick up the water that's there. Pick up the water that's there. Right. Okay. Do this. Put that into into there, and then get that thing, and put that into there. Walky walk. There we go. Right, turn that on. Right, hop up onto the step thing. Right, so that's that's what was that? I'm getting very confused. Explodium and water is key one, so that's fine. And para is that parabolium? Parabolium and seven o four nine is key three. Ha 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 ha. Right, okay. Uh, seven. Oh no, I can't remember what it was. What was what were the numbers? Oh no, how do I come out of this? Uh, all right, hey, 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 go do it wrong. Ah, possibly I shouldn't have done that wrong. I thought it might just go, ah, ah. Oh, dear. That might have just blown my chances of completing this whole thing. It was 7049. Bother. Okay, uh, maybe it'll just not do anything, but I might have just cost myself <laughs> the chance of actually retaining any form of height. Oh, botherations. Okay, never mind. I can't reach that. I can't, I can't move the box. I can't reach the thing. <laughs> I can't reach the thing. Oh, there, there, there. Yes. 
Right, gotcha. Right, and now we can run along here. And we can hop up onto these things, hopefully. Yeah, I can still I can still jump just about. Who shut the drawer? Who shut that drawer? Why is that drawer closed? I never closed that drawer. Okay, is this the second ingredient? Yes. Right, that's the second ingredient. Right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get that in here. Get that in. No, I don't know. I don't know what you're doing. Jump up onto the jump up, jump onto the thing. Onto there. Yeah. No. Yes. No. Okay. Let's just do that and just wing it. Yes. Is that in? Is it in the thing? Yes. It looks like it's in. Okay. Uh, what did I mess up before? I can't reach anything. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Jump onto that. Jump. Jump onto the thing. You've got a handle there. Jump onto the handle. Onto that handle would be good. And then I th and then ah, oh. <laughs> I think I think I may have. I think I may be too small to do some things now. I think I might be too small. Right. Grab that. Oh, it's very heavy. Look how slow I'm moving. Come on. I'm one foot four. I'm one foot four. I have a friend who we often mock for his height. This is what it's like. This is what it's like for him. And he works in a lab. I wonder if this is based on him. Right. So we're one foot four. We're now one foot three. This is this is getting worse. And uh, oh, I can, I can just about jump on that. Now, what's that made? It's ah, I must have gotten the formula wrong. I have to revert this to try again. Oh, I I I think it might be. <laughs> I think it might be all over. Let's put this use ingredient to the chemical reverter right below the bookshelf. Where's that? Oh, I don't, I don't think I can get there. I don't think I can actually get to the chemical reverter and then change that and then get over to the... Oh, now I've fallen off. <laughs> right. Okay. So, uh, moral of the story is when you're actually pressing the numbers in, try and remember the numbers. Okay. Let's give this another go. Right then, shrinking powers. Let's get on with this. Uh, Xenoleum and 0820. Right, what's in there? Exotium. Uh, and is there anything in the cupboards? There's something there. Explodium is in a cupboard. Right, okay. Is there anything in it? Right, Xenoleum plus 0820. Well, it wouldn't tell me that if I didn't need to do something. So 0820. Go. Do a thing with that. That's done that. Um, Geoctanium and water. Right, have I got Geoctanium? Where was that? No and no. Okay, Jogtanium must be somewhere around. It must be in one of these cupboards or one of the shooms. Uh, no, 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 and disappointing. No. Ah, what's that? Draconium. Oh, no, another thing. Okay. Uh, okay, I can't. Where's the Jogtanium? Explodium and Exotium equals Darkium. Explodium and Exotium. Aha, right. Okay, well, let's put those in the thing. Explodium and <laughs> Exotium into here, into the, the mixing matron there. That's good. Where's where's the other stuff? Is it in there? No. Where's the where's the Jogtanium? I can't see it. Or am I being incredibly blind? Am I being incredibly blind? That's not Jogtanium. That is that's whatever that was, draconium or something like that. Okay, uh, close, open that, close, let's open that, let's open that, let's open it. It might say mix that with a number. Ah, I bet you mix that draconium with like a number and it does some stuff. It turns it into another thing. Okay, right, there must be a thing in a drawer somewhere telling me how to do it. There must be a little thing. Right, there. Okay, draconium and microwave equals key three. Ha ha ha. Right, okay, we can get this done fairly easily. Bit bop, that's that done, sorted. Uh, okay, what's that done? That's made darkium. What do I need darkium for? Uh, Jugtanium and water. I don't need that. Is there anything in here to help me? Uh, no. <laughs> help. Send help. Uh, draconium and microbe is key to it. Right, okay. Just chuck that over there. That's that. Get out of the way. I don't need to know you anymore. That's irrelevant knowledge. Uh, Xenoleum has made Jogtanium. I feel like I'm missing a lot of ingredient, like a lot of the information required to make the things. Like I don't know what, how to make a lot of the things now. So I've got Jogtanium. Ah, here, what do I need to do with it? Jogtanium and water. Okay, so I can do key one. So that's Jogtanium. Let's get some water. This doesn't take too long at all. Bibbly bobbly and boo. Get the water. Jogtanium and water is key one. So key one is being done. So that's nice. Um, where's, how do I get key three then? Where's that? Ah, ha, ha, ha. What's this? Key two, whatever. Darkium and 2764. Uh, dark, did I just make darkium? Where did I put that? Is that the darkium? Yes. Okay. Splendid. What was it? Right. Must make note of number. 2764. Okay. Enter code. Two, seven, six, four. 
go. Do a thing. So that's going to make a key. That's going to make a key. They're all making the keys. They're all making the keys to the stuff. Right, okay. I think I'll be tall enough to grab that. Right, let's grab a box. Grab a box. Bring it over here. So I can get up to the microwave, hopefully. All being well. No, don't open the thing. Do that. Just put it down like that for now. Right, we've got this. We've got key one. We can do this. We can do this. We can, we can totally do this. Right, that goes in there. Right, move the box forward like that. Right, the microwave, the microwave is nearly done. That thing is also nearly done. Right, get this. Put the box. Oh, it's getting a bit harder to move boxes. I'm only three foot tall. <laughs> I'm only three foot tall now. It's very difficult to move about. Let's we put that at the end there and that lets us hop on. Right. This is key three. This is splendid. Right, we can still reach. We can still reach things. Okay, in. And now it's just a case of waiting for this. I think we can do it. We can do this this time. And I've made a little kind of path. I've made a path. Right, okay. Don't drop this on the ground because that would be unfortunate. Key two. That's it. That's the last key ingredient. Right. Do not fall off, you stupid man. Right. I did it. I stopped shrinking. <laughs> yes. I've done it. Do I not need to drink the antidote? Um, how do I get big again? <laughs> it's a very good question. You're the scientist. You figure it out, please. And I have one. Splendid. Yay. So I was, what, 30, uh, 30, 30, 30 inches, 30? Possibly. Oh, splendid. Okay, well, well, show score then. Why the heck not? Um, and I got 30 30 on scientist and oh, yeah, two foot six. There we go. So I was two foot six. Is that 30? Is that 30 inches? 12, 20 foot? Yeah, okay. So 30 inches, 30, whatever that bit is after the decimal point of an inch. I don't know. But there we go. <laughs> so we have done it uh, on our what? Third go? Was that our third attempt? I think that was our third attempt. So yeah, there we go. I want to go back to the menu and that's it. I just want to have a quick look at that because I thought that was quite a lot of fun. <laughs> that was very silly. So I imagine the difficulty settings are going to be how quick you shrink. I'm going to take a random stab in the dark. I assume that if you play it on, say, what was it? The intern. Play it on intern, you probably shrink a little bit slower. Scientists, you shrink the speed we just saw. And professor, you probably shrink very, very quickly indeed. And then, um, yeah, you can obviously set all the different things here. So, yeah, that's got five processing steps. Let's click that, actually. Ah, here we go. So, yes, it tells you. So, a lab intern only has four steps to follow. The processor is quicker. You shrink slower. You start possibly a tiny bit taller. You start a bit taller, and your end height uh, is... Oh, your end height is a bit higher, though. It's 11 inches, whereas a scientist is 7 inches. And a professor, <laughs> you end up 4 inches tall. That's ridiculous. You get 6 steps to do, and everything is incredibly slow. But there we go. So that was inch by inch. That was fun. That was a fun little thing. And it is free. So it's free. If you want to have a go at that, go and pick it up. It's on itch.io now. So itch.io, uh, which is like a content downloady game thing. A bit like Steam. A bit like Steam. You download games through it. It's a platform kind of thing. You play them through it. So yeah, that was fun. That was fun. I enjoyed that a lot. And for free, I don't think anyone can complain. That was good. And we even found Marig at Pierce, so I presume he is the developer. We even found his little sort of secret message as well. So that was fun. So I hope you did enjoy that. I, I thought that was a nice way a nice, fun, sort of frantic way to spend, I don't know how long I was playing it, half an hour or so, I think. But yes, I enjoyed that a lot. If you did enjoy that, please, please do leave a like. And uh, also, please do subscribe. But for now, thank you very much for joining me in the Geek Cupboard. And I will see you next time. How much cake did you have? Not a lot. You bugger off to the door. Blah. Can I be sick down our back? Oh, good. There's nothing creepy about some mysterious, ethereal humming. Oh no, Mum's been on the gin again. Mum's been on the gin and she's been watching rom-coms. Oh Mum, no, what have you done?